So, I've always had a YouTube, but I personally never used it. And I don't know what. But anyway, I started following this guy called Lead Farmer 73 by accident. Maybe the Google did this thing where they might have heard me talking about trying to start a garden or wanting to start a garden or purchasing seeds. I don't know what they heard, but it just miraculously, um, I was on YouTube and his face showed up in my feed and I pushed play and he sparked something in me that had been told to me, but I guess I'd never seen it. So I didn't really, you know how they say, I've been telling you this for the longest time and then one other person said you do it that was me so those are my containers over there with stuff I've already planted and I've been hoping to get some small tubs to do a small setting to be able to um, plant in these pots I'm looking at today necessarily plant and start my collard greens um i'm in a i don't know my zone and none of that stuff yet so don't even that professional but hopefully and i have a small herb garden on the table over there um i have a tree seeding well, I seeded it myself, got it from Niagara Falls. It's just a crab apple tree, but I grew up on crab apples, so we always enjoyed it. And my daughter had the pleasure of actually eating one a little while back when we went to Niagara Falls in August, and we took a couple of home. And um, basically, we saved one for the seeds, and I germinated the seeds, and it made a root, and voila! Now I have a tree. I guess I can walk over. I've been laid off due to the COVID. That's my little tree. I'm, oh, look at that bug. See, this is one of my problems right here. I'm scared of stuff, but I'm trying to conquer my fear. I think every spider I see is like a brown look. But I'm about to put on my dirty gloves. I don't have many gloves. I guess they get, they like socks and they get thrown away or holes or whatever the case may be. I have more gloves, but I don't want to get my new gloves dirty. They cute. Got them for $1 at Dollar General. I got these for $1 at Dollar General. I'm actually too lazy at this time to go right in there and get a drill to drill holes at the bottom, but the holes don't necessarily have to go at the bottom. I can also put the holes on the side. So that's what I'll do after I gather this dirt that it seems to work, but I don't think it's the legit portion. Like I said, I'm just trying my hand at it. I'm pretty sure um, something will grow without doing everything I've learned or everything I've seen. Um, basically, I just used topsoil, which can look a little woody, so I was real confused about what type of soil to use, but I had already purchased some soil and I paid five, six dollars for it and I thought it was very expensive to do so and then I went another time and I found this for like a dollar and fifty cent. So I bought it and I'll see what happened. And then I just add this to it. And and it, it hey it gonna do what it do. It's gonna make it do what it do. I don't necessarily get on my canopy much, but it's here. Look at that. See? Nature is doing its thing. And that's a focus. Now, people don't normally see stuff like this. But, 
he jumped. There you go, I made him lay down. I see everything. I see every bug. I've seen snake skin out here. See, I live next to a lot of woods. I have a muscadine tree. People love muscadines. I like them. Um, I don't know if it's going to work like I said, but one of these have oak. Didn't label nothing. Didn't write with no Sharpie or anything. I won't know what my stuff is until it grows. Um, one of these is okra, one of these is spinach. Don't know what that's it, that is. I don't know what none of this stuff is because I didn't properly label them. And that's just bottom line. I am germinating a lemon because I have a desire to have a lemon tree. Yes. Um, I don't know where I'm going to put it at yet, but I'm going to start it in a pot. So it probably won't give me fruit for two years but at least i'm starting now and like i said almost it's been like almost two months ago birds probably been plucking stuff in here because i know there ain't nothing growing uh, about two months ago i had the desire to want to actually do something this year and um do something with this yard plant some stuff we have too much land not to do something, and we don't do nothing, you know. We city people, we never had an interest of getting a fruit tree or doing anything with fruit. And this is where my watermelon is going to be at. I've only planted five seeds. I'm actually just learned what really German in me. I'm about to take one seed and... I'm about to take one seed and make it a root, and then I'm going to plant it in here later. So that's another project that I'm doing. I'm finding a lot of stuff to do, but I had already had these things to do when I was working every day. But I was working every day. And all work and no play made Jack's a dull, a dull boy. That's what they say. Um, this right here, I, I it pulled up, and the way it crunched i feel like it's something good so i'm gonna grow this from that pot i'm actually thinking it's gonna be big so i about to grow it from one of the bigger pots <sighs> don't know what it is uh, we did pull up some trees that was over there can't really tell you the name of them we just know that it's a lot of roots in this ground and Oh, y'all saw my license plate. Y'all see I'm from VA. But, um, anyway, so that's what I'm about to do. This has only been eight minutes. And this is my first YouTube in a long time. I guess I'll put a whole bunch of hashtag this, hashtag that, that. Um, I guess I will read the re what people have to say and tell me what to do. I really don't know, but I said I was going to start a YouTube, but I already have YouTube. What am I starting? I'm just posting. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to post, and um, that's it. Look at her. Pen right there. I heard some snapping, so I got me a little quiet. Um, but I'm definitely going to keep it under... 15 minutes I'm just I'm pretty sure anybody who looks at this is just going to see I'm just a young lady who I've been laid off from work I have a lot of times on my time on my hand I already started weeks ago it was brought to me like I said through thought and maybe the the Google gods heard me and um opened up a lot of YouTube pages for me with lead farmer 70 three that's one of my favorite guys i relate to him because i'm where he is and he showed me a lot of things and i've looked at all his videos so big ups to him and i do look at everybody else but everybody else already got a lot of money out here so um i'm gonna go ahead and fill these pots up and i'm gonna drill the holes later because it's already a little hot out here dog and i'm not about that life but i'm gonna get about that life <laughs> that's what i'm saying Halibut, thank you.